Hello and welcome to Midnight Guard Gaming. I'm your host, Mid, and we are playing Grim Dawn. I uh, hope you're having a wonderful Monday. <laughs> Had to think about that. Um, I'm on a little bit early, so yeah, I'm looking forward to playing some Grim Dawn. Um, yeah, when, and I've already started trying to think about what I'm going to do when I, because I probably won't continue playing after I finish the storyline at this time. I'm going to revisit it, though, like many other games. It's like, well, hey, it's an open option for if I'm like, oh, I'm going to jump in and play some Grim Dawn post-campaign. Just have fun, start a new character, whatever. Um, so, um, that being said, oh, and I've gotten... Um, I have gotten all of my Wolfenstein The New Order and um, Grim Dawn that I've played over the past week up on YouTube, but I am like rationing it out, scheduling it to be released. Um, so what I'm planning to do is release a video every eight hours. So I have it set for noon, 8 p.m. and 4 a.m. Um, that way, I actually have enough videos that if I don't upload anything, um, three videos will be uh, uh, published a day on my YouTube channel through next Thursday. <laughs> so a week from this Thursday, I will run out of videos on there. Um, so I am on vacation next week and I will be playing, but I'm not going to be uploading much over that time because I utilize my works internet connection, which is like super high speed obscenely powerful bandwidth like high bandwidth um advantages of having a work that has really damn good internet um so usually i take my external drive in upload my stuff while i'm at work while i'm doing other things <laughs> and then i put like my thumbnails and do all the little stuff on them when i have time like on breaks or lunch or something like that um so yeah, I, I, I'm probably going to do another batch upload Friday, my last day at work. That way, that'll get me through the rest of ne the following week when I'm off. Even though I'm still going to be playing during that week. I'm only going to be gone a couple days here and there for other things. But, um, but yeah, I want to get where I'm going to have a regular release schedule on my YouTube channel of stuff that I've been playing. So, um and who knows if I start getting such a, a, a huge backlog where I'm like weeks ahead, um, I might switch it to like every six hours that I'll start releasing stuff instead. Switch the uh, uh, publishing schedule because um, I don't want to have like a crazy amount of stuff that's never going to get released. So or like, oh, hey, I, I recorded this today and you're going to see it in five months because I have so much stuff that's just slowly petering out uh, through uh, YouTube. So but. I'll wait and see how the next couple uploads go and see how the scheduling works out because I, I, I really got to see like what an average week of content's going to be and how quickly I start going through it when it's releasing and all that. Because um, on an average night, I only play two hours, Mondays, Mondays through Thursdays. So that's, I'm, I'm at a deficit for releasing every th uh, three a day then. Uh, but then I make up for that on like Fridays and Saturdays and Sundays where I can stream anywhere from three to eight hours at a time each of those days so anyway enough of that let's get to gaming so all right we are playing grim dawn i have my level 42 sorcerer aka my gunslinger loving this looks pretty badass with his cool gear now so let's jump in here and start playing um i think we're pretty well into act four now so there's only six acts. So I figure I'm probably going to be done with this this weekend at some point, possibly. Maybe Friday. I don't know. I have no idea how long this is going to take. Um, so let's see. We have Betrayal at Fort Icon. Okay, so yeah, we had stuff that was going on. We had to go into the... Oh yeah, let's look at my... Wow, I've got a ton of reputations now. A lot of despised and hostile. <laughs> I think despised, well, actually hated. Okay. I can get even worse. All right. I 
Um, so I want to see... This is... I need to go into the armory. This is... I need to find something west... North of Fort Icon. And then this is the armory. So... Two of these are within the armory, which is right down. Yeah, me pointing doesn't help at all. Uh, right down here in the prison, which is where we're going to go. Um, let me get my auras on. Oh, yeah, I have some points, too, if I'm not mistaken. Nope, I don't. All right. I was like, I couldn't remember if I had spent points or not. Um, pet. Pet. All right, let's go. Okay. Thousand points of damage a hit. Nice. Nice rapid fire. All right, so here is the fort entrance. <clears throat> And I apparently did not actually mute my mic when I did that and muted it when I tried to unmute it. So I'm glad I'm checking those things now. So apologies for the coughing, <clears throat> even though it wasn't directly into the mic. Um, actually, let me verify everything is up and running. Everything's showing that it's okay. I just want to double check on my other computer real quick. Yep, it is. Okay. I just had this weird feeling that my stream wasn't actually working for the moment. <sighs> All right, let's make sure I'm centered up here. All right. Yeah, I, I got to take some pictures of uh, the new setup, too, since I rearranged a couple weeks back. I had some before can't pictures. Oh, can't open that. Okay, what am I, where am I supposed to go, then? Uh, I'm guessing I have to go out there then? Where is the armory? Um, okay, let's look and see. Okay, where exactly is the armory? Hmm. I have no idea where the armory is. So... We'll leave? Because I have no friggin' idea where the armory is at. Unless it was somewhere back in here. Okay, I don't have the heavy explosives yet. Okay, that's where I need to go. I need to find the heavy explosives. Which I'm guessing is somewhere around here.
I shot something or someone. I have no idea. I couldn't see him. Okay, so basically I'm just taking roundabout ways of going the same place. <laughs> well, that's a big hole in the ground. Come on, dude, die. There you go. That was a shield and a half that dude had on. Well, that big dude went down quick. entrance. There we go. Let me guess. I think this is where we need to go. <laughs> okay, making sure my arm is resting well. Otherwise I'm grinding my side of my elbow into the edge of my desk, which is not fun or pleasant at all. just going to fire blindly through this doorway until things stop coming through it. That's a cool effect when they explode. Boom. Those dead eye guys. They're annoying. Dynamite. Legion supplies. Inventory is full. Oh, really? I beg to differ. Well, that's just ridiculous. Okay. 
Okay, we can do this. We can Tetris better than the uh, machine can. Hey, look, I just got more spaces. Full. Ooh, Gatling gun. All right. All right. Guess we gotta head back to town. Fort Icon. I'll give you a good price on what I've got left. Let's see. Yes, I apparently forgot to vendor all my junk last night before I logged off. Hey, I got the supplies though. Covered the supplies. Yes, they are here. Uh, excellent. I was afraid that they had been destroyed after the recent explosion down in the armory. Thank you for recovering the supplies. Here, take some of the scrap. I'm sure you have use could use it too. Ooh, inventory bag. Awesome. Five scrap. Uh, I lost some rep with the homestead, but hey. Thank you. I'll make good use of the supplies. Wow. I have four bags. Awesome. That is great. And I'm up to 108 scrap. Jeez. Right, we're getting close to work. I don't think I'm going to go past two pile, two stacks of these. Because if I get below 100, then I'll be worried. But <laughs> Okay, so yeah, I've got anything in there. All right. Back to looting the uh, fort. I guess they found a way out of that uh, room. Okay, maybe not. They're just throwing themselves against the wall. All right. Hi there.
Love me some secret rooms. Ugh, armory explosion investigation. Yeah, and if I sound like I'm a little excited to get done with this game, it's mainly because I'm really getting that itch to play Warframe. After Tenocon watching that, oh man, it I just really want to play some Warframe, but I, I want to stick with this because otherwise I'm never going to finish playing it. So I'm like, I want to at least finish the uh, story campaign before I move on. It's a... Uh, Um, this is what streaming is keeping me honest with my gaming, where I'm going to start, I'm going to continue on and finish playing stuff that I start as opposed to just, eh, okay. Be all over the place. Okay, back this way. This is my final report on the massive explosion that has destroyed the North Courtyard. It is intended to be read with the compiled notes pulled together from the past week. With the intent of establishing a damage report and the death toll, I assembled a squad of soldiers and led them into the shattered depths below Fort Icon. The explosion appears to have, been, have blown down into the sewers, making the smell of the armory ungodly. That, in and of itself, has made it almost impossible to go down there. The plumes of smoke reduced our vision and choked the air. Crumpling walls, supports, and floors were in constant danger. Of additional collapse the explosion appears to have been centered uh, on a single large support below the armory at the bottom of the devastation we found several dead men charred almost beyond recognition they appear to be the men who went missing earlier this week my investigation indicates that the missing men were used were using the stolen black powder to make an opening into the sewer into the sewers to make their escape in closing of this report, I'd like to raise two concerns. The first is one of the men was an explosives expert <laughs> and should have been aware of the destructive potential of such powder, uh, of so much powder by itself. Uh, I wouldn't give this detail a second thought, but if not for my second concern, another of the men was, uh, another of the men has been with the Black Legion for nearly eight years with no signs of dissent or disagreement with command. Uh, in fact, he was due for promotion to a commanding position soon. Something doesn't fit here. The tale that is painted indicates sabotage from within, but who would go to such lengths to frame these men? Without more information, I cannot say with certainty what is going on, but my gut tells me that there's more in play here than, than at first 
than at first appears. Captain Frederick Bucknell. Oh, we can do this better for crying out loud. You are disappointing me, auto uh, arrange. This isn't good. This looks absolutely horrifying. I can't open that. Well, while I'm here, <laughs> may as well go back and vendor stuff. Come see what's left of my wares. Okay, we're going to move this stuff into the... into here. The more I can lock down this, the better. See you around. It'll make it easier to vendor stuff in the future. Okay. Well, pick up the polished emerald, jeesh.
Stairs that go down. Oh, I actually had explored over this to an extent, though. Apparently not. Dynamite! Ah, oh, I missed that case. Interesting. Let us go around and get it. Because it drives me crazy when I don't pick up everything. Yeah, I can't get in there. All right, we're going down then. Or up. Looks like it was going up. Hmm. So that was the entrance. Okay. Um How am I supposed to get down into this area then? Alright, I guess we're gonna go back upstairs then. We'll keep looking. gonna keep looking then for yeah, I need heavy explosives I wish I could find some that would be awesome oh, while I'm here I'm gonna go vendor junk price on what I've got left. Is the armory at? I can't open that. All right, we'll head back into the fort proper. Apparently, oh, bad guys! is fast. Hmm. That's a Endless supply of bad guys running through there. Or seemingly endless.
Hey, you guys uh, see the armory around here? I'm looking for it. go back here um i need to find out where the heck is the damn armory at well i wait a minute i Within Fort Ar Icon Armory. Okay, I was down in the armory then. Um. Hmm. So that was the armory, but apparently I need to figure out a way of getting through the one area. How can I get down there? Alright, let's vendor stuff again real quick before I head back down in there and look around more. I'll give you a good price on what I've got left. Ooh, pardon me. Explosives. The armory is on the north side of Fort Icon. Do not tarry. All right, I am in. Okay, in the armory. All right. I am a little bit lost though, because. Could not get through that area. Oh man, yawning in like crazy.
Oh, now it opens. It wouldn't open before. Oh, he's he's really gross looking. crap ah that was not a good thing running right into that okay yeah commander lucius is is pretty gross looking now i'm glad i popped that portal right outside his room oh uh before i forget move what the heck I'm like okay don't move at all that's just silly and we run back again we bravely run back Whole lot of nope. How? Die! Hollow there we go. Victory. Hollow victory? Well, you can say that. I have looted all that I can. <laughs> I shall depart now. Oh, that's very fortunate that I pop out right there.
Whoa, what the? Uh, something exploded. Was not sure what that was. Oh, um, I guess someone's shooting artillery at me. Okay, we're gonna go back in. Hopefully they will give some insight as to why I'm being shot with artillery there. See anything you like? going to give me a lot of bonuses which I could use. That's actually doing more damage. And that boosts my damage a little bit. Alright, so I'm not going to use this one. Mm, I can sell that too. See anything you like? Iron well spent. Good work down there. We need to secure a forward position at the necropolis immediately. Where do you need me? We cannot simply march our forces straight into the necropolis. The cult's minions will descend upon us in force, and we will be crushed before we can even get near the Tomb of the Watchers. Instead, we will put your unique skills to use. Make your way into the necropolis past the Plains of Strife, and secure the nearest rift gate. Once you've done so, Algrim will come through with a contingent of our men. With the element of surprise on our side, we will strike with the enemy from the bay. Sorry, I was just testing to see how far my camera, where it would cut off at. I could probably drop my green screen down about two feet, because <laughs> I don't think it needs to be as high as it is. Okay, we can. All right, so all right, I will head to the necropolis at once. Come see what's left of my wares. No, I don't care. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? You're not from the Legion. Oh, cool helmet, man. Perhaps there's something you could help me with. Something that can't involve the troops. Uh, what is it? With the recent ethereal attack, I cannot allow this deception to carry on any longer. Anisteria, the witch who is allowed to enter our fold, must be put down. The Inquisitor insists that she is not to be harmed, but the, tr the trust he has in her is misplaced. Commander Lucius was an honorable man with a and a dedicated soldier up until he was possessed by the Ethereals. I refuse to believe that Anister Anisteria's witchcraft was not, the not involved in his corruption. Uh, as we are all under strict orders not to harm her, I need someone outside the Legion, such as yourself, self, to handle this for me. Will you enter the Fort Prison and deal with the Wretched Witch? Hmm. What is... Oh, okay, hold on a second. I'm going to look on the wiki 
Because this is a pretty complex one of which side you take. So... Hold on while I look at the wiki, see what I want to do here. Um... Benefits of letting her live. I can unlock the outcast faction equipment, bounty table, and quest line, which increases outcast reputation and decreases Black Legion reputation. Okay. Access some of the best Aether resistance augments in the game, able to be applied to weapons and armor. Interesting. Benefits of killing her. Unlock the Ford Icon prison dungeon with Anisteria as a boss at the end and a great source of Black Legion rep farming. Elite mobs and gear. Access to Outcast Secret, a legendary helm that only drops from. Oh, kick my subwoofer. Really need to move that because it's not in the best spot. Uh, Outcast Secret, what is that? Is this something I would want? Ooh, it's cool looking. Um. Ooh, that's actually kind of cool. Um, hmm. I think on this playthrough I'm gonna I'm gonna probably side with um the Black Legion. So I think I'll kill her in this on this difficulty and then When I play another character or go to the, or actually when I go to the next difficulty level, then I will not hurt her and go with the outcast. Um, why does Creed want her kept safe if she is dangerous? Inquisitor is convinced that Anisteria has, has valuable information, but I found her to be nothing but a web of lies. She's a witch tainted by the Ethereals and needs to be exterminated. Well, I'm touched by Ethereals. Let a witch in the fort. I always believed it was a mistake, but Creed the commander and commander Lucius wishes to hear her out, and she arrived at our gates with her hands above her head and surrender. Somehow we're in there, Tristan was allowed to roam freely, spreading her ethereal taint throughout the fort and weakening our resolve. Hmm. So I guess I'm going to get the option. Or ooh Okay, I guess I gotta take, I will deal with the witch and then I'll get the option to kill her once I get down there. Yep, speak to Anisteria in the Fort Icon prison. Okay. Okay, they're not really gonna the outcast secrets, the outcast bounty table. Hmm. Let's 
it's very tempting to not kill the witch. So I can farm the, uh, Uh. My, what a curiosity you are. Yeah, that's a kick-ass helmet. What is this, a human and not yet? There's an aura about you, stranger, but I cannot see the spirit or sense the spirit. Tell me what fate has befallen you. I was possessed by an ethereal, but it left me at the hagman's noose. What a marvel you are. They say that to become one with an ethereal, you must lose all that defines you, but it seems there is more to the mystery than rumor lets on. The Aether holds many secrets, but if you are held from me, there are those who fear such power, but that is not that is why you are here, no? Uh, Captain Reeve wants you dead. Why are you un why are you under Creed's protection? The good Inquisitor considers my knowledge of the Aether and the ability to foresee the Aetheriel's attacks to be of great value, something many in the Legion have trouble grasping. Creed has personally requested that I be kept safe so that uh, what I know is not lost to, s to some soldiers' wild accusations. Oh. Why should I trust you? I assure you I came to the Legion with the full intent of helping them battle against the Aetheriel, Aetheriel invasion. My information is, has already saved many lives, but Captain Reeve and the others refuse to see it. Will you join them in condemning me for what I do as well? Uh, very well, I will defy, defy Reeve. Uh, mm, I'm so torn. Because this will be an easy way of getting... You know what? Yeah, I'll defy him. Wonder, yeah, because on the next difficulty, I will kill her and be able to farm Black Blackguard rep or Black Legion rep. For now, I'll, I'll do uh, outcasts. And wonderful now that we put the, this unpleasantness behind us. I was hoping that you could hear me out. Nobody in the Legion will help me, but perhaps you will be more understanding. Uh, what is wrong with all the commotion during the ethereal attack? I'm afraid that most of my personal stores were damaged or even destroyed. If I, if I'm to continue my work here, I must have another ancient heart, blood of Cathan, and tainted brain matter. They are pivotal to my research, but acquiring them on my own is simply out of the question. For the for this old crone, will you be so kind as to gather these materials for you? <laughs> I already have the objects you require. Well, there we go. That was easy. Wonderful. These should last me some time. Say, have you ever heard of the tale of the great beast, uh, Baronath? Uh, no, but I'd I'd like to hear it. Wow. Um, it is a legend as old as time, it seems, with countless retellings of different heroes and sometimes even uh, different creatures. In each of them, a great hero tracks down a monster that's been tormenting local villages. The hunt takes the hero ten, ten long years through forgotten lands and to far off shores, but it always ends atop a mountain where... Uh, Baronath is impaled upon a spear of bone. The beast plummets from the peak, and with its spilled blood uh, were born the fiends and monsters we dread to this day. The details are muddled in folklore, but one fact remains constant. Baronath once lived. To have a piece of such ancient lineage could prove useful to my spell work, and I believe I know where to where one such spawn of Baronath dwells. The people of Burwich call it Kaliska, the Bone Hunter. Uh, it hunts within the area uh, called East Marsh, but makes its dwelling up in the crags. Track down this creature for me and slay it, then harvest one of its fangs and bring it to me. All right, I'll acquire it. Writ of the Outcast. Huh. can't open that. All right. I guess we're done in here then. And with that, I am actually going to go take a quick five minute break. I need to top off some water because I am out and I am parched at the moment. When we come back, we'll take care of seeing what we can do on these other quests. So let me set my timer real fast. All right, and I will be back in five minutes. See you shortly. <laughs> 